Hello guys and welcome to Let's Play Pokemon Reborn, this is episode 37. And this mill tank is calm and where's the collar? Tauros is staring at the mill tank intensely. Mill tank senpai doesn't seem to notice him. Mill tank notices the orange berry you hold. Do you want to give mill tank the berry? Obtain moon milk. Okay guys, we're in back here in Iolia Valley. And, uh, I still don't know what was changed when we used the purple crystal crystal in that one cave. I can't seem to find whatever it is that changed. Maybe nothing changed. But I saw it. So, something had to have changed. And, I forgot to use a repel, so, you know, this happens. That's great. Well, actually, Ampharos might level up from this. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Level 56. Excellent. Okay. Use a super repel. I'm going to have to go back and get some more soon. Relatively soon, anyway. Okay, so there's got to be a door that I just haven't looked in, right? I've checked all the doors on the left side of the water, on the left side of the river there. That's where I got the thing for this crystal, so it's definitely not going to be up there. And that was probably blue. It's very difficult to find it. Right, this is what it is. Okay, so it has to be on the left side of the water. I'm gonna go look for it, guys, and we'll be right back. Okay, guys, it was on the left side of the water. I was wrong. I just had to unactivate a purple crystal I had already activated. So, let's see where this takes us. Okay, so there's a Healy thing. I guess we'll uh, heal. That's pretty cool. Okay, uh, that implies a battle, though. Ooh, yeah, there's a big door here. That definitely implies a battle. Let's see what happens. Welcome, Jack. I'm glad you have reached here safely. Luna, I finally found you. How can this be? Only Jack was supposed to reach me here. I tagged along. I want to apologize, Luna. There is no need to apologize. I hold nothing against you. Now please, if you will, leave us be. We do have business, after all. No, Luna, you don't understand. I just... I want what's best for you. And I was really confused, and... Bennett, that is quite alright. You need not say more. No, I... Luna, I love you! I beg your pardon? Ever since you first moved in with us, I couldn't stop thinking about you. You are, without a doubt, the most beautiful girl I have ever seen, and I... Um... Please, stop. Luna, would you be mine? I'm sorry, but I have to go now. Jack... He will not be able to follow me without the crystal keys you hold, so please join me when you're sure we will be unaccompanied. That is, farewell. No, wait, you you haven't even given me a proper answer. Ha, <laughs> she disappeared again, huh? Maybe she's just shy. Maybe she feels the same way and doesn't want to admit it. Or maybe I'm just pathetic. That's what you're thinking, right? But she's letting you through. Why? I know, Jack. Why don't you give me that key that she was talking about? And if you say no, then I'll just have to take it from you. Oh, wow. I didn't get a choice. I kind of expected to be given a choice. And then I would have said yes just to see what happens. Lipidopterist. Okay. Hmm. Power gem. The crystal's light strengthen the attack. That's actually really, really good because... Bug is weak to rock. Let's switch to Golem, and we'll use Stone Edge to one-hit the rest of his Pokemon. It'll be double super effective against this Yanma here. Oh, really? That's unfortunate. I really hope that I can hit it. Yeah, okay, cool. Interesting. Power Gem gained power from the light, but that move didn't. Butterfree. I guess we're going to switch back to Ampharos. That signal beam just 
wiped Golem out. Not much special defense, I suppose. Hopefully this doesn't wipe Ampharos out. Come on now. Ooh, we got really unlucky there. Okay, so we're gonna have to switch Pokemon. We're gonna toss out Dragouch. Dragouch is now level 54, and we've got Dragon Pulse. Quiver Dance is like a really OP, uh, calm mind. I could not think of that. Double not very effective. We're gonna use Toxic just so that we can get its HP down every turn reliably. And then I guess uh, Hydro Pump will be normal effective, so we might as well hit it with that. We won't get we don't get stabbed from it anymore, unfortunately, because Dragouch loses its water typing in favor of a dragon typing. But well, okay, it had good power, but I guess not. Either way, we'll be doing more and more damage every single turn. Come on, it, I'm it's weak, but ah, uh, that's still pretty good damage. I think we're gonna have to use a Moo Moo Milk here. I mean, why not? We've got like 50 of them. In fact, we'd have 90 if, uh, you know, I stood there for 20 minutes instead of, like, 10. I tried my best to write a script so that it would just press the C key over and over, but no luck, unfortunately. Yeah, your leftovers are kind of useless when uh, my poison does more damage every turn. Oh, of course, you've got a Moo Moo Milk, too. Doesn't matter. I still do extra damage every turn thanks to my poison thanks to my toxic excellent damage stop using signal beam ah drag Alge needs a move that increases his special defense I mean he already he already has pretty good special defense and it's not very effective you'd think it would do less damage level 55 scyther uh, yeah, I guess we'll change Pokemon I mean Bug is weak to fire, right? So let's do it. Plus, Pyroar's got some serious, serious speed. Hopefully, this overheat will one hit it. Okay, excellent. Pyroar levels up to 60. Our first level 60 Pokemon. That's excellent. Okay, Venomoth. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and switch again. We'll switch to Gardevoir, I suppose. And we'll hit it with. Oh man, what do we have? Uh, we'll just hit with Moonblast. Oh, Signal Beam's gonna wipe Gardevoir out, I believe. Oh, it didn't. Oh, Fairy is not very effective against Bug. I didn't know that. Or, Poison. No, it's because it's Poison type. Huh. Let's see if Shadow Ball's better. Huh? It might be. Who knows? Right, we've got extra damage for that. That was not good, though. <laughs> not great, Signal Beam. That's going to wipe Gardevoir out. I gotta say, this is a difficult battle for certain. Hopefully we're fast enough to hit it with an Overheat. We've lost the uh, stat downs, so... Oh, well, we can hit that with an Overheat. It didn't kill it! Oh no, those Quiver Dances! That signal beam might actually take Pyroar out. Oh, it didn't. Okay, come on, overheat. We're going to do less and less damage every single turn. We're going to try strength. Maybe we'll uh, get some good damage. Moonlight. I hate any move that heals. Because this game makes it so difficult to deal any damage to any Pokemon in existence. Because why not? Signal beam. Ah... Signal Beam is a really strong move. Really? I didn't even know that it could confuse. But, well, that ruined that plan. Hmm. Let's see if... Maybe we can hit it with Golem's Stone Edge before it hits us. Let's hope we're really lucky. We're not. We're not lucky at all. Zero luck. <sighs> that is unfortunate. Really, really unfortunate. We may have to redo this battle because uh, there's there's really nothing I can do at all in any way, shape, or form. 
Another quiver dance. Ah, oh, that is super duper fair. What am I gonna do about that? That'll be not very. If oh, it's bulletproof, right? Okay, well that's that was a critical hit too. You gotta be kidding me. Let's try let's try hammer arm instead of wood hammer. Maybe we'll, okay that well that's gonna one hit chest not one hundred percent chance. Oh man. Okay, it didn't one hit him. Uh kinda surprised, not gonna lie. I do believe we have two revives. I think we're gonna use one of them right here. Who to revive though? Even Pyroar couldn't do it. We could revive Golem. And then maybe we can Stone Edge it. Because Quiver Dance doesn't raise their attack. It raises their... Uh, or defense. It raises their special defense. But honestly, this is really going to come down to luck. Absolutely pure luck. Chestnut's going to die right here, unfortunately. There's nothing I can do about that. Yep. Okay. We gotta be really lucky here. I know I can't die in one hit. That's great. But we gotta be really lucky and hope that this will one hit Dustox. If it doesn't one hit Dustox, we're in trouble. Really, really big trouble. It did though. Okay, excellent. Excellent, excellent. We're gonna send in Drag Alge. Just to, uh, I don't know. This is his last Pokemon. She would never... No! I won't give up. I'll make her see. He's crazy. Okay, so we really can't let him get a bunch of Quiver Dances in. Okay, Signal Beam. Excellent. I don't think that'll kill us. No. Okay, excellent. I don't think we can poison it, but we can... Oh no, it's got a Quiver Dance now! That was really, really bad luck. So what we can do, we're going to use another Moo Moo Milk on Golem. This will prevent Golem from being one hit. Um, and all we can really do is hope that Quiver Dance... Or that stupid Pokemon. Stop making me say stupid things. All we can hope is that Stone Edge one hits it. What are you gonna baton pass to? You're the last Pokemon, idiot. Well, if it actually keep nope. Okay. I was gonna say if it keeps being stupid, we might actually do this without even switching to Golem. But really, guys, I hope you're crossing your fingers here because I don't want to have to redo this stupid battle. I didn't expect this to battle this battle to be so difficult. Actually, not gonna lie. That's going to get me down to one health, but Sturdy is one of the best abilities in the game. And Golem. It... That's spectacular. Uh... Yep, okay, so we'll be back, guys. See you in a minute. Okay, guys, uh, this took me forever. Man, I tried so many things. The thing that appears to have worked, and we'll see that in just a second here is I used Golem to take out his first Pokemon, Larvesta. Then I switched to Gardevoir, and since I had Golem out first, he wanted to switch to Yan Mega. Gardevoir traced Yan Mega's speed boost, so I just kept calm minding and uh, healing, you know, when I could. So eventually I was faster than every single one of his Pokemon, and Yan Mega killed itself because I believe it's holding a life orb. So, uh, we won. That was a terrible battle, though. Man. So that's what I amount to, is it? In the end, I'm just a fool, aren't I? Stupid. Stupid to think that she would love me. Stupid to tell her. Stupid to think I could beat you. Stupid that my training hasn't paid off. Yet. I'm going. Elias promised me he would take me to the top, and I'll hold him to that. And when I'm there, she'll regret refusing me now. Just watch me, Jack. One day, you'll see. Everyone will see. Man, he's like that kid who comes to school with, uh... Good luck in your battle. I promise, next time you see me, things will be different. 
It's like one of those kids that brings a gun to school and kills everyone. You know, crazy. Wow. This is interesting. Let's save it again. Huh, maybe I'll get rock climb right here. He has left, right? Very well, let's try this once more. Welcome, Jack. I'm glad you were able to reach me here. Children, even some adults, are often scared of the darkness. Why is that, I wonder? Is it because they think that awful and sinister things come here to dwell? There are too many of those outside for that to be true. No, perhaps they are simply afraid of their own imaginations. Darkness is what draws out the greatest potential, but for some, infinity can be, an, can be a terrifying abyss. Please, allow me to introduce you to an infinity, lost, scattered and fractured. It shall return piece by piece. Are you ready to meet the next eternity? Great, okay, so this is a stupid gym battle. Great. I can't... Dark Dreamer Luna. The gym's kind of, the gym leaders kind of have, uh... Hmm. How do I put it? Stupid names, I guess? Ooh. And also Carpenter, really? March Hare. Man, the Pokemon have stupid names, too. Okay, I'm burned. Oh, that's bad. It decreases my attack by half. Unfortunate. Hmm. Hyper Potion. Yep. I mean, I guess I have Moo Moo Milks now, but... They're still not perfect, so... Might as well try Stone Edge, I guess. Oh, we're not gonna hit him with Stone Edge now. Golem's probably gonna kill itself, yeah. I mean, that's fine. It, it was gonna die anyway. Anyway, the only thing super effective against Sableye here is... Moonblast. Well, of my move set, that is. Don't you hurt yourself, Gardevoir. You just pulled off an amazing battle, and you better win. Thank you. Thank you. You are spectacular. Bandersnatch? I... How am I supposed to know what Pokemon that is? It's a Tyrant. How would I know that? Come on now, be reasonable. Oh, that was a lot of damage with Stone Edge. Okay, Chestnut, let's go. We're gonna use Wood Hammer. Hopefully we can one-hit it. Come on now. Oh, that was unlucky. Iron Head. Seed Bomb, and, okay, three of her Pokemon are, two of them, two and a half, are down. Jub Jub Bird. Well, I know that is Honchkrow. Watch. Called it. Aren't that great, guys? I think so. Please don't one-hit Ambros. Excellent. Not excellent. I should have paralyzed it when I had the chance just now. Should have paralyzed it again. Oh, it's normal type now! You know what? We're gonna paralyze it now. Screw it. Uh. Oh no! I used Thunder Wave again! And it used Roost again anyway. Okay. What terrible luck. Nice, it's paralyzed. Okay, awesome. I'm pretty sure that Honchcrow and Murkrow are the only dark birds. Can't think of any others. Humpty Dumpty. Who could that be? Huh. We're gonna try Drag Alge. We'll see. It is a Malamar. Crap. Okay, Buck would be double super effective here. Maybe we'll have to go back and teach Ampharos Signal Beam. Anyway, let's uh, Toxic it. If Drag Out survives. It did. Good. Good, good, good. And now we're going to go ahead and heal our Pokemon up here. Uh, that's the wrong bag. Hmm, milk. Okay. We're going to heal up Chestnut because... It occurs to me that Hammer Arm would have been double super effective against Tyranitar, and that's really what I should have used. And 
unfortunately, you know, too late for that, really. But, you know, whatever. It takes forever for the poison to ramp up, you know? It's unfortunate. But, you know, what am I going to do? Superpower. Of course it has superpower. Why do they have these moves? These moves don't make any sense. This is going to be another battle that we've lost. You realize that, right? That's what this game is. It's ridiculous battle after ridiculous battle. You have to get lucky. That's really all it was. I got lucky last time, and boom, I won. I'm not lucky this time, and boom, I lost. So, I'll try a few more times, guys, and uh, if I can't get through it, you know, this will be the end of the episode. So, uh, see you in a bit. Actually, guys, turned out this battle was a lot easier than the previous one. Man. Stored power. No. Wait. What is stored power? Let me see what this is. User attacks target with stored power. Stop learning it, yes. You have overcome the gateway into the soul of eternity. Though its beauty is tarnished, your soul shines with hope. I pray you farewell. You fought especially well. I expected no less. Now I may present this to you as Dark Pulse. Wait, well, not the badge, but, you know. With the Eclipse badge, Pokemon up to level 70 will trust you. Please treat them well. Finally, I have one last gift for you. Dark Pulse. Told you. Please use Darkness' as embrace as you see fit. I shall be remaining here for a time. I feel that I, like all the monsters of which children fear, shall be safer in the dark. As for you, did your friend not say that he would move towards a gate city? I know not what dreams mesmerize the station guards, but perhaps it's time for you to discover that yourself. I do hope we meet again someday. Until then, farewell. Save the game right there. Oh, there's a... Did I not use this before? Now we're nice and healed up. That's excellent. And I think I'll meet you guys back at a gate city. See you there. Okay, guys, we're coming up on the uh, gate city. Well, gate. And uh, here's Kane. Are my Pokemon healed? Yeah, they are. We're good. Hey, these guys are still conked out for whatever reason. You think something happened? If we could go past here, there's no telling. If we go past here, there's no telling what could happen. It may even be a long time before we can come back. You sure you're ready? No. Crap. Okay, so what do I do? Um Okay, let's see. I I have 34 or and well, do I really need more? You know what? I'm going to back up my save just in case things go wrong. I'll be right back. Okay, we're all set. Let's see what happens here. All right, Nitto King. Knock, knock, open up the door. We're here. I mean, that works, I guess. Come on. <laughs> Why wouldn't I be able to go back? It's quiet. Too quiet. Okay, what's going on here? Hello? Anyone there? Hmm, dead silent. That's not typically a good sign. Huh? Wait a second, is that... It can't be! Aya, what are you doing all the way up here? Wait, isn't that his sister? Hey, Aya, wake up! Answer me! Aya? Ha, huh, well, what a weird place to sleep, dork. I don't know, I'm not just gonna leave her here, but... Well, I kind of feel tired myself. I think I'll just take a nap and wait for her to wake up. Uh, do you hear something? Rawr! Diamond Dynamo! Whoa! Uh, whoops. That was close, what do you think you're doing? What am I doing? What are you doing? This Saturday night, baby. I'd like to take you out. Know what I mean? Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Usually people ask that before they try to pound me, not after. Okay, no, hold on. What did you just do with that giant mallet? You want to find out? Like, really? What? Where could that possibly have gone? He's checking me out. 
Oh, yeah. Hey, please tell me I'm not this bad, Jack. <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying... Uh, yo, wait, uh, bitch? What? What's up saying, uh, bitch? You gotta get out of here. Why? And who even are you? I am Terra. Hear me roar! Acceptable alternative names include Terror, Terraria, Terrarararararara, Mega Terra, Super Elite, Lion Tamer, and Queen O Booty. I got some sweet, sweet words of sugar for you, baby. Oh yeah, so lend me your ear real close, like. Get out of here! <laughs> Cause any pony who stick around gonna fall right asleep, yo. Exhibits A and C. There was an exhibit B, but I ate him. Delicious. What? Who said that? Is it because of this place that everyone falls asleep? Correct, Amundo. You win. Your prize is a brand new car. But I ate the car too. Whoops. Now get. Don't worry though. I got your friends up one way, first class, to ride to safety. Let me explain. Tara, what are you doing? Your mom. Hello. Batter up. Home roar. What the fuck is a physics? <laughs> it's no worry now, they're safe. We sing Hakuna Matatas and go join them, yeah? Ready? Ah uh, I think we'll walk, thank you. Just tell me where you sent Aya. BB, you won't be able to walk after I'm done with you. You might be surprised. Come on, let's get out of here before we fall asleep too. I can already feel it. Fine, all troops, move out. What? He, he, he just spins away. And here it be, the famous Agate Circus. It's no sleepy people here. So I guess you're one of the clowns then? Rongo, I am a fierce and mighty lion tamer. I also tame seal. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Anyway, yo friendly peeps probably fell around this joint somewhere. I'm gonna go hit the showers. Peace. Cha-cha, real smooth. <laughs> Do you really think she's okay? I, I mean, after being knocked over a mountain wall by a giant mallet. Let's just split up and find it. Yeah. Those are English. Cotton candy for sale. Melt in your mouth goodness for both you and your Pokemon. Don't be shy. Cotton candy. It's 6,000! It's a revive, though. Oh, that is spectacular. We can buy revives. Super expensive, but we can buy them. Okay, let's see. Super repels. Ultra potion. We don't actually need Ultra Potions right now, but actually Super Repels though. Always need some Super Repels up in here. We're gonna grab 21. Yeah. 2015. What are the chances? Power up your Pokemon. Pledge your allegiance here. What'll it be? Oh, Fire, Water, and Grass Pledge. Fire Pledge. Eh? That'll run you three Red Shard tokens. None of them can learn it. I figured Pyroar could learn it, but never mind. Nothing. This way to excitement. Oh, really? A trainer? I kind of I, I didn't expect that. Not gonna lie. Clown Drolly. Okay, and then their next Pokemon's gonna be Spinda. Calling it right now. Right, that was the wrong move. I should have used Woodhammer. Um, that just makes me faster than you. You realize? Nope. Yeah. No. No. Yeah, I lowered my speed. Clay doll. Okay. Hmm. Not gonna lie, didn't see that coming. Also, that clay doll is not black. That is a very light colored clay doll. What's up with that? Are you having fun yet? You know it, buddy. A lot of shops around here. It's nice. Purple shard. Welcome, I can reteach your Pokemon moves that they've forgotten for the price of one heart scale. Don't be shy, learn those new old tricks. You've got the goods, see, do you want the moves? No, anytime you want. Step right up and try our challenge for a chance to, chance to win a rare fossil prize. It costs one green shard to play. I'm not ready. What? Oh, uh, the genderless people. No, they're kind of ugly. 
Well, the one on the left is ugly. That's some ugly hair. Come on now. Presto, Poncho, Pineco, Changeo. Allow us to change the very essence of your Pokemon. Ability capsules are sold here. Next one goes for two red shards. Don't be shy. Potential is your middle name and ours. No need. No problem. Who's next? Balloons. What's a circus without balloons? Get them here. It's just selling air balloons. 100% doctor approved. Need a quick treat? Common candy, red hots, chewing gum, saltwater taffy, peppermint, and pop rocks. Huh. It's actually pretty cool. Not gonna lie. Let's see. Let's switch uh, Drag Alch out front. He's like 10 levels low, but, you know, whatever. Circuses are fun and all, but I've been here way too long. My home is in a gate. I happened to be here when they closed off the city, so now I can't go back. What is this, a drink machine? Why would anyone buy these? I'm not actually on breaks. So don't tell anyone. Okay. So he's got three Pokemon. Execute. I believe they're grass and poison. No. You know what? We're going to switch Pokemon. This will level Drag Alge up anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Doubt it's going to use Sleep Powder again. Sword Sands? You're kidding, right? Why can a bundle of eggs learn Swords Dance? Well, isn't that special? You're going to die of a burn. There's nothing you can do about it. Raise your attack all you want. That's not going to unburn you. Wake up, idiot. Barrage. Man, uh... That's some really high attack stat you got there. <laughs> Executes dead. Pyroar levels up too. Wait, what? Wait, what? Drag Alge levels up. Pyroar levels up. Girder. Ah, uh, oh man. Let's toss out Gardevoir. Super effective with its psychic. Fight me. Fight me in real life, Girder. Yeah, what then? You die. That's then. At least the battles here aren't too difficult. Delibird. Uh, I guess we'll toss out Ampharos. Electric should still be super effective, even though it's ice type. It is level 70. Frost Breath is always a critical hit. I don't understand. Why have it always be a critical hit? Why not just give it more damage? It seems really gimmick. Well, that works. It seems really gimmicky to me, to be honest. Aw, oh, do I have to go back to work now? Yeah. Lazy bum. Anyway, guys, uh, let's be a lazy bum in the next episode, because that's all we're doing today. We got a good bit accomplished, though. We beat the lep 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 lepidopterist, right? Yeah, something like that. We beat Luna. We're in a circus. I mean, this is like my third time in my life going to a circus. That's pretty cool, right? Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.